talk about Jesus and we are going to read the Bible and we are going to sing songs. Oh, it makes me so, so, so happy. I am so happy that it's time for church with my friends. Are you happy? Are you happy? Yeah? Oh, when I'm happy, you know what I like to do? I like to clap my hands like this. Can you clap your hands? And when I get super duper happy, I like to stomp my feet. <laughs> like this. Stomp my feet. Stomp my feet. And when I'm super duper 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 happy, I shout amen! Amen! Can you shout amen? Amen! Like that. And when it's time for church with my friends, and we get to sing songs, and hear about Jesus, and read a Bible story, and go on an adventure, I get super, 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 duper, 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 duper happy. And I do all three. I clap my hands, I set my feet, and I shout amen! You know what that means? We're gonna do one of our favorite songs. If you're happy and you know it, let's start today off right. Everybody stand up. All the kids and all the moms. with the rest of the day at church okay guys but first we gotta we gotta do our rules we gotta put our listening ears our looking goggles and our happy hands are you guys ready reach in your pocket reach in your pocket <laughs> oh, I got them I got my listening ears okay when we put our listening ears on today, we're all going to have ears that hear what God has for us today. Did you know that God wants to talk to you? He always wants to talk to you and he has something special for you. We just got to make sure that we're listening to him, okay? Let's put them on. Click, click. I'm listening, God. Whatever you want to say to me, I'm listening. Okay, what's next? We gotta put on our lucky goggles. You gotta reach down deep. Reach down deep. Way down there. Got them. I got them, guys. Okay? I got my looking goggles, okay? When we put these on, we're gonna see what God has for us today. When we read the Bible, when we go on a Bible adventure, we're gonna have eyes and see all that he has for us. Cause we know he's a good God who has good things for us. Let's put him on. Wow. God, you're so good to us. Wow, 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 wow. Now the last thing we gotta do, what do I gotta do? I look at my hands. Look at, look at, look at. We put on our happy hands. God gave us happy hands. With our happy hands, we clap. 
and we praise, we shout amen just like we did. And we're nice to people with our hands and we keep them nice and clean. We remember to wash our hands lots and lots, okay? With soap and water, we get them all bubbly. We keep them clean. Jesus gave us happy hands. He gave us happy hands, okay? All right, we are ready for today. Who remembers our bottom line for this month? We're on the last week of this series before we get a new bottom line and a new memory verse. I wonder how many kids out there know their bottom line. What is it? I can believe in who? Who can you believe in? That's right, Jesus. I can believe in Jesus. Let's stand and put our hands on our hips and say it together. I can believe in Jesus. Mom and Dad, you do it too. I can believe in Jesus. I can believe in Jesus. Oh, I see, I see him over there in my Bible. He's like right over there hanging out. Hey, hey, I can't wait to get into our Bible story in a minute. But first I wanted to see who knows their memory verse too. I think all of you guys have it. Let's say it together. These are written so that you can believe that Jesus is the Christ the Son of God. John 20, 31. Oh, oh my goodness! Whoa, 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 whoa! You know your memory verse! You know your memory verse! Did you know that your memory verse comes from the Bible? Oh, I've got this picture of Jesus in my Bible. I love the Bible. I love talking about Jesus. The Bible is the most amazing book ever written. Do you have your Bible with you? If you don't have your Bible, you gotta go run and get your Bible, okay? I'm gonna run around my rug 10 times while you go get your Bible, okay? Ready? <gasps> One, two, three. Bible. The Bible is the most amazing book ever written. Give your Bible a big hug. Can you give your Bible a big hug? Oh, we love God's word. I love learning about Jesus. I can believe in Jesus. Did you know the Bible talks about a place that we're going to go to be with Jesus? Do you know what it's called? It's called heaven. And if I believe in Jesus and you believe in Jesus, one day we get to go to heaven. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Can I read you a story from the Bible that's true, that's about heaven? Yeah, can I read you a Bible story? I love the Bible, it really is my favorite book ever. Okay, it starts off with a guy named John. John was one of Jesus's very good friends. It says, many years later, the disciple John lived on an island. Ooh, that sounds like fun. I want to live on an island. While he was there, an angel came to him in a vision. Oh my goodness. And in the vision, a bright light surrounded Jesus. And he spoke to John and he said, do not be afraid. Write a book about what you see and send it to the churches. A letter to the churches? I love church! If he sent a letter to the churches, I want to read it! Don't you? Let's see what he said. Oh, that looks like a super cool place. Oh my goodness. In the vision, John saw God sitting on his throne. And a rainbow sparkled all around him. And John saw that everything bad on earth had come to an end. No more bad stuff! And then John saw a new heaven and a new earth. 
And God said, there will be no more sadness or crying or pain. And I will live with my people forever. (gasps) Oh, it's so beautiful. And there's no sadness. There's no more crying. I want to go there. Do you ever cry or get sad? Well, when we go to heaven to be with Jesus, there will be no more sadness, no more tears, no more crying. It's going to be super awesome. And then Jesus promised, I am coming back again soon. Oh my goodness. We get to be in, in heaven with Jesus forever. If I believe in Jesus and you believe in Jesus, we're going to be in heaven one day with him. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That surely does sound like a great adventure. Woo! I love adventures. I love going on Bible adventures. And Ollie, Ollie, did you hear that story? Yeah? Are you ready to take us on an adventure to your clubhouse? Yeah? All right, are you ready to go to Ollie's clubhouse and go on an adventure with him? Yeah? If you're ready, give me two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. All right, guys, let's go. Who? Who? Know what time it is? It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have learning to That should do it. Oh, hey everyone, I'm Manny, and I did the coolest thing today. I went to the eye doctor. Can you tell me what this picture is? It was easy to see the pictures at the top of the chart, but the teeny ones at the bottom, those were harder. It was so much fun that I made my own eye chart to practice. Let's put it on the wall. Now you can practice with me too. Here's the fun part. You have to cover up one eye. Take your hand like this and cover up one eye. And hold it right there. Ready? I spy with my little eye something that is green and brown and has branches. It's a tree! You spotted it. Now let's test your other eye. Take your other hand like this and cover up your other eye and hold it right there. Ready? I spy with my little eye something that is red and means love. A heart! You did it! You spotted something on the smallest row. Great work! Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie! Hello, Manny. Who? Who? Testing your vision, are you? Hi, Ollie. Sure I am. I made my own eye chart to practice seeing. That's a fun thing to do. But I've got something even better to spy. It's true. So let's hear this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. <gasps> well, hello. I'm Aisha, and welcome to my cupcake food truck. Check out today's special. Ta-da! I call them Taste Like Heaven because each bite is the best thing ever. (laughs) Which is exactly the true story I want to tell you today. Get your I Spy eyes ready so you can help me tell the story. Awesome! If you're ready for a story on the count of three, yell, tell me a story. One, two, three. Tell me a story. (laughs) 
Raise your hand if you have ever heard about a place called heaven. Great! That is what our story is about today. A very special place called heaven. One day, Jesus was with his friends, the disciples. He told them he would be going away soon. He said he was going to a special place called heaven to get everything ready for all of the people who believed in him. He said this place was very big and it had a lot of rooms. Later, after Jesus died and came back, he visited many of his friends. Jesus wanted his friends to see that he was alive with their very own eyes. Jesus talked with them and ate food with them so they would see he is alive and believe in him. Do you see Jesus alive? Help me look for him. I spy with my little eye. Jesus is alive! While Jesus was talking and eating with his friends, he told them to go and tell everyone that he is alive and he wants to be their friend forever. Then something amazing happened. After Jesus finished talking to his friends, he went straight up into the sky, through the clouds and into heaven. All of his friends saw him do it with their very own eyes. Can you see a sky with clouds? Look with me. I spy with my little eye. <gasps> A sky with clouds! <laughs> While Jesus' friends were standing there looking at the sky, two angels came and asked them, why are you looking at the sky? Jesus has gone to heaven, but he'll be back. Wow, we know heaven is real because Jesus told us it is real. And we can believe Jesus because he always tells the truth. And everyone who believes in Jesus will get to be his friend forever and live with him in heaven one day. Can you see why this is one of my favorite true stories from the Bible? And Jesus is getting a place in heaven ready for everyone who believes in him. Did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Hey there, Ollie, tell me, who can believe in Jesus? I can believe in Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can believe in Jesus? I can believe in Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus has a special place with him in heaven for me and for you. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow. Jesus wants to be our friend forever. He's even made a special place for us in heaven one day. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you just like got it, get it? Got it! Good! I love spying fun things on my eye chart, but the most amazing thing to spy on is this, my Bible. Because the Bible teaches us that Jesus wants to be our friend forever. He's even made a special place for us in heaven one day. See you guys next time. Bye. I spy with my little eye. Wow. Heaven sure does sound amazing and beautiful. I can't wait to see it with my very own eyes. I can't wait to be with Jesus forever and ever. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I'm so glad that I believe in Jesus. Do you believe in Jesus? Yeah, can you say, I can believe in Jesus. I can believe in Jesus. And I love reading Bible stories, true Bible stories so that I can learn about him and follow him so that one day, I can go to heaven too, and so can you. These are written so that you can believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God. John 20, 31. I can't believe he wants to be with us forever and ever and ever. Man, he must really, really, really love us. Jesus loves me, and Jesus loves you. Did you know that Jesus loves you so much? Jesus loves you. Can you say Jesus loves me? Jesus loves me. Makes me think of 
my, one of my favorite songs when we sing about how much Jesus loves us. Will you sing Jesus Loves Me together? Yeah? Let's everyone sing it. Come on, guys. Oh, I love this song. loves us. I'm so glad that I get to go on Bible adventures with you guys. Thanks for being such good friends. I love going to church with you guys. Now before we go, we're going to say a quick prayer together, okay? Are you ready? Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Give them a little clap. Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Fold them in your lap. Thank you, God, for the Bible, your holy word. Thank you for sending Jesus, and thank you for preparing a place for us. Thank you for heaven. Thank you for our friends and for our family and for our church. God, would you keep us all safe and healthy? In your name we pray, amen and amen. Now you guys know that you can pray and talk to God whenever you want, not just when we do it together. You can pray when you're in your bed or in your playroom or in the kitchen or on the couch, wherever. You can talk to God whenever you want. Now I will see you at church next week. Bye, guys. <laughs>